Hey everybody, um, today I'm going to show you how to use console projector on your uh, profile and uh, keep it projected from like being filed complaints against and getting banned in the end. And all you'll need to do is download USB XDAF Explorer uh, and also audio. And console projector <laughs> of course I'll have links to all of these in the description box and um, let's get started okay you'll need um, a USB drive for this um, you can use export 360 if you have that or the transfer cable with the transfer cable or you can use the flash drive which again is what I'm going to be using this video all you need to do is just format it to the 360 and copy your profile onto it. So we'll plug it in. And the computer is going to recognize it here in a couple of seconds. And then what you're going to do is you want to open up USB XTAF. Um, I guess I'll say this right now. I'm not responsible if you screw up your profile or you do something wrong so that you can't use it. It's uh, I didn't make any of the programs or anything and as long as you use them properly you should be okay. But this is kinda on you if you screw it up, so throwing that out there. Just in case you Okay, now that USB XTAF is opened, um, all we gotta do now is just click File, Open Drive, and automatically pick up the USB drive and access the files inside. Okay, now that it's um, started up again, just go to Root, Content. Find your profile, go to FF00. Now you can extract it or you can just drag and drop it to the desktop or wherever you want to copy the file to. Now I'll just drag and drop it. Uh, So we close it down. Now we go and open up Mario. Okay, now that Mario is opened up, what we're going to do is we want to open up the profile. And you drag it into Mario. It's the fastest way to load it up. At least I find it to be. Otherwise, you click open, find the file. Hmm. Okay. If I can get this to move up here, there we go. So, the profile I used, I already used console projector, as you can see. Everything's already nulled out, and I saved it under set 2. So what you do right now is you, can, you pick a set, so um, I guess to use this I'll just go to set 3, and what you do is you'll click save ID set, and then you'll click, and you close this down, and you leave Mario up. Now what you do is you'll go to console protector, open that up. Okay, now you can click click here to open file. Okay, now you would uh, select your profile that you want to edit. Click open. Click protect IDs. And now click OK. Close this. Um, down here, it made a backup file before it numbed the IDs. 
and um, just in case you need a backup file for your profile. So now, you, which is a very nice thing to have. So now you just drag this back into Audio. Wait for it to load here. Now you just click reload IDs from set three, the set that you used. Click rehash and resign. And now there you go. That's all you need to do. So you just close down Audio since you don't need it anymore. Go to USB X tab. Delete. Um, delete your original profiles in there. And drag the new one in there. And that's it. Just close the drive. Close USB X staff. Remove the drive safely. Uh, I suggest do that because sometimes it might be writing stuff in the background, and there was a and there could be a delay write fail, and then your profile gets screwed up, and you're gonna have to go through a lot of trouble just to fix it. Okay. Now just unplug your flash drive. And, um, that's all. You just plug it back in your 360, sign in your profile, and it's going to be console protected. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Check out my other videos. I have one on modding a gamer score and for modifying your uh, Modern Warfare 2 um, gamer tag. So you can have like the buttons or whatever and change colors of your gamer tag. Um, yeah. Happy modern guys. Uh, please rate good.